Hi everyone, it's Dr. Karen Leggett and I wanted to talk to you a little bit more about DHEA. So there are two forms of DHEA. We actually test DHEA-S. S stands for the sulfated group that is attached to DHEA when the DHEA goes through your liver. So this is really important because the two forms of DHEA are really important for our body. So when you take DHEA, the kind you get over the counter, it's converted in the liver to DHEAS. The liver puts a sulfate group on it. Now, standard DHEA is very protective for the nervous system and gives us immediate energy. It also gives the short-term protection for the nervous system. Now, the DHEAS is long-term protection and gives you energy over a longer period of time. So both are important. Now, DHEAS doesn't cross the blood-brain barrier, but here's the cool thing about that. The brain can actually make DHEA and then convert it to DHEAS by itself. It also can take up DHEA. Now, this is why you want to take DHEA orally up to 10 milligrams as a woman. Now, yesterday or the last video, I told you start with five, move up to 10, and we make anywhere between seven and 25 milligrams a day when we're in, say, our 30s. So there's some controversy on that. Now, I'm gonna tell you why you don't wanna take over 10 milligrams orally in the next video. Okay, so I hope this was helpful to you. If it was, thumbs up, share it, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.